So welcome students. In this question, you're given that you have a set 1 to 20 natural numbers and 4 numbers are chosen from the set without replacement. So what is the probability that the chosen numbers form an AP if they are arranged in order? And the second statement, the first statement is given that the probability that the 4 numbers form an AP is 1 by 85. And the second statement is if 4 numbers form an AP in the set of all possible common differences is equal to plus or minus 1 plus or minus 2 so on up to plus or minus 5. So first let us find this. So what is the probability that the chosen numbers form an AP? So the denominator is easy to find first. So effectively I am finding and choosing 4 numbers out of these 20 numbers without replacement. So the denominator is 20 C4 right? The denominator is 20 C4. Now you need to find the numerator. What is 20 C4? 20 into 19 into 18 into 17 divided by 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. So 4 5s are 2 9s are. So you have some number in the denominator. Now how many of these selections will form an AP? So how do we analyze this? So if the four numbers form an AP, they should be of the form A, A plus D, a plus 2d and a plus 3d. Now this first number is a natural number. So this common difference should also be a natural number. If this common difference is a fraction, so you will not get all natural numbers. So the first number is obviously a natural number and the common difference should also be a natural number. So the different ways in which you can choose different a's and d's, so you get different numbers in AP. So how many different ways can you choose the numbers? So my number A can go from 1 to 20, the number A can be going from 1 to 20 and the number D should be such that my A plus 3D should not go beyond 20, it should be less than or equal to 20. That means the common difference should be less than or equal to 20 minus A by 3. Common difference should be less than 20 minus A by 3 or I will write it like this. So A should be less than or equal to 20 minus 3D. This is better. A should be less than or equal to 20 minus 3D. Now, let us see the cases. What are the possible A's and D's? So possible A and D. Now if D is equal to 1. So if D is equal to 1. So if D is equal to 1, you have A should be less than 20 minus 3. A should be less than or equal to 70. That means A can take 17 different values. A can take 17 different values. For common difference is equal to 1. Now if the common difference is 2. If the common difference is 2. So A should be less than or equal to 20 minus 6. 20 minus 6. That is 14. So A can take 14 different values. Similarly if the common difference is 3. If the common difference is 3. 20 minus 11. 20 minus 11. That is, A can take 20 minus 9 is 11. So, A can take 11 different values. If the common difference is 4, the common difference is 4, A can take 8 different values. If the common difference is 5, if the common difference is 5. So, 20 minus 15, A can take 5 different values. If the common difference is 6, so 20 minus 18, A can take two different values. If the common difference is 7, A is not possible. So correspond to these diff common differences, A can have these many options. So what are the total number of options for A and D? So you have 17 plus 14 plus so on. You have 6 terms in AP. So 6 by 2 times first term plus last term is 19. That is equal to 3 times 19 is the number of A's and D's that can be taken so that they are in AP. So let us substitute this here. So the numerator becomes 3 times 19. So the denominator is already 5 into 19 into 9 into 17. So 19 and 19 gets cancelled 3 times. Uh, 5 into 19 into 9 times 17 by 3 is also there. So this 3 goes up, so 3 and 3 gets cancelled, 
that is equal to 1 by 85 1 by 85 so s1 is true or s2 is obviously false because the common difference of plus 6 is also possible thank you